my god, if Lauren burns to death, I'm going to die. I'm going to be so upset. I'm Kelsey and I'm single so I thought it would be funny if I tried the 100 bay challenge It's a challenge in the sims 4 where you have one sim and they are meant to have 100 boyfriends girlfriends and significant others all Essentially at once there are some rules to this challenge if you're interested in those I will post them all below it is a challenge that I have Handcrafted alongside my partner EA and the sims so thank you so much to the sims and EA for sponsoring sponsoring these videos. I feel like that's such a dream come true to like make my own challenge. And also there are some international friends that are actually doing this challenge along with me. Emmy Lou from and Lemon from Taiwan are both doing this challenge as well. If you are doing this challenge along with us, make sure to let me know. Tag me, tweet me if you wanna reach me. Also make sure to be uploading all of your bays and builds using the hashtag 100 bay challenge onto the Sims 4 gallery so that I can download all of the bays. I'll be looking at all the bays in the next episode and also be downloading some of your favorite date spots. So I'm very, very excited to be doing so. Okay, so we back. We back out here with little miss Lauren and Peachishme. What has she been gotten up to? She's on a date that ended up in death last episode and did not seal the deal with our 10th bay, unfortunately. So we are only at nine bays still, but we're trying to keep trucking along. Last time I did add an extra rule to the challenge that you must go on a date with a bay if they request you to go on a date with them. You can't say no. So you do have to drop everything and go on the Dates. I didn't do that in episode one, but I just realized like it was making it too easy to like not do those things. So, and you do need to maintain the relationship. So let's go back to the lounge that we were at in Mount Comoradi with Lauren and see if we can maybe just find someone new. I don't know if we should keep barking up this tree. Makoto, we've been trying. Actually, he's feeling kind of pleasant. Okay. Oh, he wants to say goodbye. Well, I'm not going to let you say goodbye. Instead, I'm going to form a group and I'm going to have a first kiss. So we're we're gonna first kiss anyway. He's feeling happy-ish, so let's go for it. Oh my gosh, it's working. It's working, the first kiss is working. All we needed was a break, you know, from filming, and it happened, so okay. Can we ask you to be my boyfriend now? Kiss his neck. Like, why can't we just ask you to be boyfriend? There it is, ask to be boyfriend. Yes! I was about to give up. I should never give up. Oh my gosh, Makoto, do you wanna be my boyfriend? Yes! Okay, done and done. Okay, Makoto, I no longer wanna see you unless I have to, but Makoto is now officially our 10th boyfriend. Let's go. We're hungry, but we're not sleepy. So actually let, oh, we can't order food at that bar. Can I? order food over here? Yes, order food. Okay, let's get onigiri. Sounds really good, actually. Let's go get onigiri. You're my boyfriend now. Hooray. Okay, now I'm immediately gonna walk away. We're gonna go get some food, and then we're gonna maybe call up. It might be too late by the time we're done eating to call up anyone else, so we might have to just go to someone's house, but it might be good to send a little flirty text to Julia. So let's eat really quick first. Can you just sit down and eat your food? Where are you going? She's finally eating. We're gonna just go over to, I think, maybe Jules's house? because we haven't seen him in a minute. I want to make sure that we're still keeping that relationship up. Maybe we could even introduce ourselves to Bess. Maybe we could be a throuple, you know? Like, brighten her day. Kiss Jules's hand. Be like, hello, Bess. It's good to see you. You know, we don't have a good relationship with her, but we have a relationship, I suppose. So we are just chatting with Bess, apparently. Hi, Jules. Ooh, try for baby. No. Oh, he's feeling very flirty. Perfect, perfect. Ooh, wait. Kiss 10 Sims. We are now have five Sims kissed. We're going to give him... Dive for thrills? What does that mean? Wait a second. Is that woohoo? That seems like a secret woohoo. We're gonna give him a hug, maybe. Get to know him. Let's give him a hug because that's one thing that we want. Oh, they got a sentiment. You know what? It's been wonderful to spend time with you. We've made some great memories. Aw, that's very... Very nice. She does want to give a romantic gift. Give a love day gift the alone. See, like, I got you a gift. I cooked it myself. You're welcome. It's a bunch of corn that I grilled. Ew, he didn't like it. What? Why didn't you like it? That was rude. I can't believe he didn't like my romantic gift. I'm going to give him the earbuds. Maybe he'll like that. Oh, he loved it. 
it. He loved the earbuds. Oh, is he giving her one back? He gave her a rose. That's sweet. I love the joy that you bring to my life every waking moment of every day. And he gave her a sweet gift. Okay, that's very, very cute. All right, now they can go to sleep. We've maintained that relationship enough. We're gonna sleep back in his bed. Is Bess upstairs? Oh, there's another. Oh, interesting. Once she's done with that, I think maybe we'll take a bath and maybe get some food and then start on a new bay. My idea is to probably just go for Julia since we already kind of have something going with her. We also, who else do we know? We still know Candy from episode one. Oh, she wants to woohoo with Jules. Oh my, oh my. Schedule a date. She wants to schedule a date. Wow, we are that comfortable that he just peed in front of us. Okay, I did need to go to the bathroom myself, Jules, but I guess we'll go. Is there a bathroom downstairs? There's so much room and there's one bathroom in this whole house. Are you flipping kidding me? I'm gonna kick you off the toilet because I need to go. So there you go. We pee in front of each other now. That's how close me and Jules are. Dive for thrills. That's cracking me up. I kind of want to do it. Listen, she does want to woohoo with Jules. It keeps popping up. Dive for thrills. It just sounds very funny to me. Let's like have some breakfast. Yeah, we'll have some fruit salad. Oh, hey, Lord, it's me, Makoto. Do you want to go on a date? Mall, I'm hungry. But yeah, okay, we'll go on a date. Sorry. Sorry, Jules, I have a thing, I gotta go. Okay, we're here with Jules. Jules, is there any food nearby? I gave away my elotes, I should have kept it. Is there a grill nearby? I mean, there's this place, which is a coffee shop. Oh, here's a grill. Hot dogs is cheap. Let's go grill some hot dogs. Come sit over here with my grilling hot dogs. Date. Grab a serving together. This is part of our date. We're gonna eat hot dogs. Oh my God, he just glitched. Oh, what, is, what does he have? He already has a hot dog. Did he grab it when he glitched? Oh, well, ask a risque question. Maybe I'll put it in our inventory next. So we keep all our hot dogs. Feeling good though, having a nice little hot dog. Why is he uncomfortable? Did you have a bad day? Is that why you're uncomfortable or do you just not like hot dogs? Ooh, she's feeling flirty now. She wants to flirt with someone. Okay, you can flirt with your boyfriend here. You can flirt with him. We do need to like scout out, see if there's anyone else maybe walking around that we could kind of like meet, you know, set up. Who's this? Teulia Top Santa. All right, let's have like a cheerful introduction. Advic looks kind of angry, but I like the stash. So let's do a cheerful introduction to him. Jade is, oh my gosh, our girlfriend Jade is here. Our girlfriend Jade is here. Pete, our girlfriend Jade is here. Uh, maybe we shouldn't bring this date in here. Maybe it was a good idea that we ended up over here. So hopefully these people will come to me to meet me. But yeah, yeah, we're gonna just be extra nice. We're gonna joke around with her, just be friendly. How do we talk to people without flirting? All she wants to do is flirt. Oh, here he comes. Here's the other guy with the mustache. Oh, well, I guess this is goodbye. Um, Don't call me ever. Okay, so he did not enjoy our date, which is kind of rude, Makoto, because we actually flirted with you a lot. You're just annoyed we didn't go in the store. I just wanna make sure, yeah, he's still my boyfriend, so it's fine. I can't help it that I'm a friendly person and I am interested in chatting with everybody, okay? Discuss stressed mood. Okay, we're gonna talk with these two. Are they? both okay? Why are they both so tense? Okay, let friendly maybe hug, hug her because we want to hug someone. That's not romantic. And then let's go say hi to Jade at some point. Okay, we're fine. Everything's fine. Is she annoyed with us? Like heartfelt compliment. Be like, you, you know, I really love your hair. Okay, there she goes. She's going into the store. That girl was really grumpy, so I don't know. But we're gonna go to the store and say hi to Jade as if we weren't just on a date with someone else. Daniel Hobbs. This guy is cute. This girl's cute. Sayori Yamaguchi. We're gonna brighten our girlfriend's day though. We're gonna try to like kind of set some stuff up while not knocking things down. Oh, he, he walked around to stand next to her. That's a good sign. Heartfelt compliment. Please feel better. I know you're scared. I don't know why he's scared, but we'll just be absolutely hilarious to this guy. And hopefully that'll make our fun go up as well. <laughs> Tell a joke about Sunset Valley. It didn't really help a ton. Wait, no, it's starting to help. They are both uncomfortable and they did not like it. Okay, who is this? Arun? We'll, we'll also introduce ourselves to Arun. We're meeting plenty of Sims, so this date was not 
Oh my gosh, this is our other girlfriend. Have you heard painting paintings at the Romance Festival? Is the in thing right now? Wanna try it out? Yeah, I do. Not that I need to be trying to date new people right now. I only have 10 bays. It's like only one tenth of my goal of bays. Okay, here we go, here we go. But we should, we should, you know, give a heartfelt compliment <laughs> to Adrian. She is probably one of my favorite bays. I'm not gonna lie. She is the cutest of our bays. So let's paint a painting with Adrian. Ooh. Unfortunately for us, there is not a painting next to each other, but let's do a little small classic painting. Who's this? Lizbeth. Lizbeth is really pretty too. I'm finding all the pretty Sims lately. So here we go. Lizbeth, come on out. Say hi. Oh, she's sad. And then there's also Akira Kibo, who is also very cute. Okay, go paint a painting. We're gonna go paint this painting. It is weird. Sometimes I'll look at her face and go, oh my gosh, that is my face. And sometimes I'll look at her face and be like, that's not my face. But she's doing her little painting at the romance festival. Oh, she's tense because she's not having fun. We need to have some fun. What would be fun for her? Maybe go to someone's house that's TV or swing on a swing. I don't know. Apparently art is not fun for her. Oh, we're making the same painting that was painted by someone else over here. But it's a cute one. It's of a llama. Maybe we should keep it and try to gift it to one of our bays. We're going to keep it and make it a very romantic gift. Our fun is down. We need some more fun. Maybe we should drink. She's talking to someone over here. Our bae is. Who's she talking to? Dominic Fires. Okay. Well, keep talking to him. That's fine. I don't really care. I'm not a jealous girl because uh, I also have a million bays. So let's drink some soccer tea. Hopefully, if we flirt it up with someone new, that might like give me some romance. Oh, don't fall with your tea, girl. Don't fall with your tea. Oh, no. She sat back down with her girlfriend. Okay. We need to find someone new. I guess we could go in here and talk to this guy. Let's go give him a flirty introduction. Hopefully no one follows me. No one follow me. Actually, we need to do enchanting introduction, don't we? She needs to be enchanting. And maybe this is karaoke. She could do karaoke with him. Maybe that would give her more fun. Make him love you, girl. Akira. Okay, he liked it. It was very awkward though, but he liked it. Aw, oh, man. Someone just started karaokeing the moment I said that I wanted a karaoke. Isn't that just how it always happens? He stopped. Okay, sing a duet, a country duet with Olivia Kwok. Why can't we sing it with Akira? Maybe hold his hands. Go flirt with him. Go flirt with Akira. Maybe that'll give you some fun. Oh, watch karaoke together. Maybe that'll give her some fun. Okay, they are flirting. No one's around that I think we've dated before that would bother her. Okay, this is giving her a lot of fun, watching the karaoke. Good, 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 good. I mean, it'd be more fun if you go, oh my gosh! I didn't mean to watch the karaoke with Adrian. I meant to watch it with Kira, but apparently we accidentally, oh, come on. There's no people we could karaoke with. All right, well, that was a waste. Maybe sing a solo pop song. Our girlfriend came back over, so we weren't able to go sing karaoke by ourselves. Our date with our girlfriend, Adrian's almost over. And another day wasted by dating people we're already dating. But here we go. We're gonna sing some karaoke. There we go. Oh my God, my girlfriend just left. Are you kidding me? My girlfriend just walked out while I started karaoke again. I have no audience. You know what? I'm doing it for me, apparently. Maybe now I know how to get my boyfriends and girlfriends to walk away from me. All right. Well, cool. All right. Let's uh, let's travel. We're going to go by ourselves. Who, who have we not visited in a minute? Who has fun things to do? Maybe Sulani? Oh, no, she doesn't have a house because she's a mermaid. Ooh, but McGinn's is not. Okay, let's show up at her house. Is that weird to be like, hey, this is crazy. I met you, but I, I don't have a place to stay. She has nothing to do. She has one single bed. There's no way we should stay here. I don't think either of us are really in the mood for any of this though, but it's fine. We'll at least be able to like start a little bit of flirt before we go sleep somewhere else. I mean, we could try to steal her bed from her, but honestly, I feel kind of awkward about it. <laughs> well, maybe we'll do a date with her tomorrow. Okay, she is super cute though. We are feeling very flirty. Well, she counts as a sim. We've now kissed six out of 10 sims. Oh my gosh, first kiss already? Oh my gosh, they are getting along like a house on fire. Oh my gosh, this is just happening. You you know, when people just vibe, they really, it really is just that easy. I never would have expected this. I really just came over. Ask to be girlfriend! Oh my gosh. Ask to be girlfriend. I can't. Wow, that happened really quickly. Oh my gosh. Lizbeth was just immediately down. Wow. We, we took a girlfriend pick together. Wow. Lizbeth is now officially my new girlfriend. We have 11 bays now. Lizbeth, it was so nice to like start dating you 
you, but I'm like really exhausted and you have like one bed. So I'm going to go, but thanks for having me over. I'm never coming back to your house, Agron. Okay, who else has like a good house? We could go back to Jade's house. I feel like we went to Jade's house so much, but we I think we could go back. We'll travel to Jade's house. It looks like Jade's not home. Hopefully her roommates let me in. Okay, can I, can I come in? They let me in, perfect. Let's go up into Jade's room, the room that we always sleep in and just sleep in Jade's room. It looks kind of like, yeah. Oh, nope, there's Jade. There was Jade. Be like, hey, Jade. It's always so good to see you. Want to do a sleepover? Yeah, give her that good kissing. Lay it on her and maybe have a deep convo. Woo, we kissed seven out of 10 Sims. That's right. Now we can finally go to sleep. Hooray. At least the day was not done without one new bay onto our list of bay. Oh, it's summertime and it's new skill day. I know the perfect skill we should be working on, charisma. Oh my gosh, she's happy because she had a first kiss, but she's really hungry. All right, let's cook something up. Oh, actually we have hot dogs in our inventory, I believe. Yes, she's gonna get a hot dog. Perfect, grab a serving of your own hot dogs. Oh, our hot dogs are spoiled. Okay, we should throw those out. But Jade's here. We don't know the rest of her roommates that well. You got pretty good taste when you come to the flea market and help me shop. <gasps> That's not really a date, but it kind of is like a date and it's with a new guy. So we should definitely go. All right, we're going. Okay, here we are with, uh, what's his face? Advic. Okay, I'm gonna just do a cursory check to make sure we're not dating anyone in this crowd of people that just spawned. Fabulous, we aren't. So let's kiss his hand. Immediately go for the kill, which will get us to eight kisses in our aspiration as well, which is perfect. Share some dude uh, skill day spirit. We are feeling very flirty right now now, or he's feeling very flirty, actually. He is liking this. I feel like he invited her out originally as like kind of friends, but it's definitely more than friendly right now. We should ask him if he has a significant other though. Advic is single, perfect. Let's go buy something, get that out of the way, even though I literally don't have a place to put it. Oh, that's expensive. Let's haggle with her and see if we can buy the voodoo doll cheaper. It would be kind of fun to use a voodoo doll. I don't know if you can like make them fall in love with you with the voodoo doll. Um, we can also punish people people we don't like. That's kind of messed up, but I'm kind of curious. <laughs> Ooh, she said absolutely not. Is there any other things we could buy at the fleet? Oh, these look nice. Okay, let's buy some candles. The oil lamp is cheaper. We're buying the oil lamp. All right, we did it. Let's go chat with our date. Although I should have bought these because I actually like those. <gasps> Akira's right there. Oh no. Okay, heartfelt compliment. Let's be friendly until Akira walks away. We'll just be friendly. We don't want to like put all our eggs in one basket. You see, Akira's not even there anymore by the time I got here. He's not even around. We can flirt all we want with this guy. Pickup line. Ooh, she wants to become flirty. All right, let's become flirty. Let's flirt a lot. Ooh, yay. Oh, we leveled up our charisma skill, which means that we also, we're charisma nine, which is good, which is very good. But that also means that we officially did the new skill day thing, I think. Okay, we are turning flirty. We did it. First kiss. Ask him to be boyfriend showed up. Ask to be boyfriend. Yes. That's two, baby. We got a new boyfriend and he's got a mustache and a nose ring and a ring. He said, yes! Advic is officially our boyfriend. Luckily, Nina Caliente is not dating us because she looks very angry just now. Lucky number 12. I mean, Nina Caliente would be a very interesting prospect for us as well. So let's chat with Nina Caliente. It is now a very awkward encounter because we chatted with her, but let's brighten her day. She's still chatting with uh, Nina Caliente, who then just became very uncomfortable and walked away. <laughs> next time, Nina, next time, we'll get ya. Go use the toilet. Our bay is, is come back. Do you have a house, Advic? Do you have like a nice house? They still haven't had any fun. I can't believe all this dating isn't fun for her, but honestly, dating isn't as fun for me either sometimes, so I get it. She's working on her speeches. We should probably just like give him a final little, little sweet talk and, and call it. We didn't level up a skill after all. Okay. Well, we need to pick a skill to level up, I think. I thought we just leveled up charisma though. Maybe we should just try to level up charisma on him. Okay, we're gonna do Brighton Day. A lot of sweet talking. Oh, nope, he wants to leave. Why are you leaving so awkwardly slowly? <gasps> oh my gosh, our girlfriend just walked in and that's my cue to leave. So goodbye everyone, goodbye. I'm gonna go somewhere else now. Actually, you know what? Why don't I ask someone on a date? Is it too late for a date? It's it's 5 p.m. I don't think it's too late. Akira or Julia Wright are probably our two that we haven't gone on a date with. Let's go 
with Julia Wright. Julia, would you like to go on a date? Hopefully she does. Okay, she does want to go on a date. All right, so we are going out on a date. Where will we go that no one's gonna know us? Maybe Oasis Springs? Go to like one of these bars? Yeah, hopefully no one recognizes us while we're there. Fabulous, so bright and day. She wants to hug someone. We can hug her. We're hugging, we're being cute. Let's go up into here maybe and sit together on one of these couches. So far, so good with not knowing anyone here. That's encouraging. Hello, please. Okay, get to know her. Then we need to be both flirty at the same time. So it's time to go into a flirt category. Oh my gosh, Naoki, please don't join our conversation. Okay, we're trying to be cute and make a move. Okay, and there's a pregnant woman as well, Danielle Ennis. Please everyone stop trying to talk with us. Okay, Julia is single, that is good. She's majoring in physics at University of Bright just are very cool. Bold pickup line, blow her a kiss, tickle her, look deeply into eyes. First kiss. Okay, we are crushing this date. Confess attraction. We're getting there. We're getting there. Yes, we're both flirty at the same time. Our needs are so low because of the fun thing. I don't know why this isn't necessarily fun, but let's ask her to be our girlfriend. Wait, we didn't even kiss her yet. Let's first kiss after. Maybe she's a little more old school. She's really cute though. Okay, I think we're asking her to be our girlfriend. This was fast. Wait, who's this guy? Salvatore Fowler. Okay, we gotta talk to him next. We now officially have another girlfriend. Julia Wright is our 13th bae. Boom, we got her without even kissing her for the first time. But now we need to do like a funny introduction to Salvatore because he looks ca you. Okay, we got nine Sims kissed out of 10 now. That is perfect. Okay, hello, Salvatore Fowler. How are you today? Oh, he's coming to sit. No, he's not. He's not coming to sit by us. Okay, she just got a dr No, she got some food. She got some chips. Maybe we should get some chips too. Order food. Ooh, get some french fries. That sounds delicious. I want some french fries. Very much, thank you. Julia, I believe, is on campus, so I think we could go back with Julia, but we probably would be- Oh, wait, who's this guy? Oh, it's Daniel Hobbs! Yeah, the paranoid boy. Ooh, it looks like we're in a conversation. She's really hungry. Why don't you grab a serving of whatever that is? I don't know what that is. I think those are your fries. Go eat your french fries, girl. Eat your french fries while you tell outrageous stories to these men who are next to you. Okay, we're gonna talk with this guy. It's an awkward encounter. Why is it awkward? Did we do something weird? Did I make my girlfriend mad? Julia Wright. I guess go kiss her at some point. Well, you don't wanna kiss her in front of this guy though, he's gonna think something. So let's just do something funny and tell her an outrageous story. Why is this so awkward? We just wanna be fun. Okay, that guy walked away. So I guess we're good with just chatting with our girlfriend, eating our fries, enjoying our time together. There we go. Oh, she tickled us. That's very cute. Okay, is the date over yet? Nope, it's not. Okay, well, let's go. Where did that one guy go? None of these are the guy that I was thinking of. Wait, oh no, Lisbeth, Lisbeth. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Try to cheer her up. Oh no, Lisbeth just caught us. Lisbeth just caught us with our other girlfriend. Oh no, 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 no. This is bad. Oh no, is Lisbeth still our girlfriend? Okay, technically Lisbeth. Beth is still our girlfriend, but she's really sad because she caught us on a date and we can't like cheer her up much without like ruining things with Julia. Oh no, uh, 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 I don't know what to do in this situation. Tell her a funny story. Julia's asleep, Julia's asleep. Can we kiss her hands? No, don't kiss her hands. Julia woke up, Julia woke up. Oh my gosh. Lizbeth, we worked so hard. She's like, D are you dating someone else? Be like, Lizbeth, we just met last night. I mean, we, I, I, you're allowed to date other people. Date was legendary and Julia is like looking back at us and leaving, which means that we can try to patch things up. Let's make sure she, she knows that we love her and that she's the one for us. Oh, Lizbeth is leaving. Lizbeth, come back. Lock the camera. Where is she? Where is she? Stop, Lizbeth. Lizbeth, don't leave us. Don't leave us. Please, we'll offer you a rose. Anything, Lizbeth. We're running after her. Please wait. You know, I had this date. You're the one that I care about, you know, in your weird, uh, weird outfit choices. I think you're fabulous. I would never mean to hurt you. So we're gonna just try to keep flirting and sweet talking. I think Julia's fine. Okay, wait, Akira, we have like negative? Did Akira see? Oh no, Akira just saw, okay. We are really trying to balance everyone here. Oh my gosh, Akira's like, eh, that girl's already in a thing. I don't wanna deal with her. Oh my gosh. Well, 
well, you know what? I already ruined it with Akira, so it's fine. I'm I'm gonna just focus on Lisbeth. Yes, okay, we got proposed back. Not that I'm going to propose, but that's kind of where I, I stand at. Like, the relationship is high enough that it seems right. Okay, everybody else looks good. Okay, so we are good. We have all 13 still in love with us. Everything's fine. Eventually, we will probably not be able to maintain them all at once, but I'm going to try to maintain as many as possible. Okay, so we're saying goodbye. We're like, goodbye. Thanks for chatting with me. Lauren, you are super tired, so let's travel just by ourselves. We got two new bays today. However, we did kind of annoy one bay, and we kind of ended things with someone that we were kind of talking to for a sec, but it's fine. We're fine. This is fine. We'll figure it out. Okay, let's go back to Vlad's house. I mean, we could try to date someone else. In the Wait, is this our bay? Seema lives here? Okay, let's go visit Seema. I didn't know Seema lived in that neighborhood. That's really weird, but Seema! We're here. Can we come stay at your house tonight? Seema, it's been a minute. And then maybe we'll try to crack on with Akira, even though he caught us. I feel like we could still make it work. We're playing a dangerous game. It's getting harder and harder. Let's go flatter Seema, and then we really need to take a shower. Seema, I love what you've done with the place. You really have garlic, honestly, everywhere. New skill day was awful. Dang it. I meant to, like, up my skill. I am so close. I was really close to getting my charisma all the way up. All right, we're going to go take a shower in her shower. It is so chaotic. We might have to start just dating people in their homes because this is bad. Okay, we need to have some fun. Let's like watch a fun little movie. The Clumsy Sisters with Seema. We'll watch a little comedy movie. It's been days since she's had any fun. Okay, now she's watching it alone apparently. Well, let's watch the comedy channel. Go watch comedy. There you go. There's her fun going up. Apparently Seema didn't want to watch a movie. Okay, great. Her fun is finally up again. We're gonna cook a little bit. Ooh, bills have been delivered. Oh, shoot. We gotta go home to pay our bills. It's 180 simoleons. We have no power, water, or other taxes, so we just have the lot tax. We own a lot and nothing else. Eat your eggs and toast, queen. And then you, you can go to bed. Seema slept in the kids' room. That's weird, but okay, Seema. We got a bed to ourselves. A full king-size looking bed, so. Hey, Lord, it's me, Julia. Do you wanna go on a date? Yeah, I do. Luckily, all my needs are up. So yes, sure. Sure, Julia, I would love to go on a date with you. I would love nothing else. And it's not that I wanted to go on date with other people today. We're on a date with Julia. Let's brighten her day. Let's focus maybe on, on getting her charisma up. We're gonna just keep being super friendly. I think we're in the clear right now. We have to keep eagle eyes out for <laughs> any of our other bays. Make out in closet? Sure. This date just keeps getting better. Excellent. So we're clearly doing a very good job on this date. All right, they're gonna make out in the closet next to Yousef and these two, Rashawn and Bianca. None of our fun went up. What the heck? And Lauren is going outside. I don't know where she's going. Going. She's gonna chat with Yusuf uh, apparently now. Oh, she just gave us a little flirt. She likes us a lot, but I still want like our charisma to grow up. I need my skill to go up. Charisma. Oh my gosh, we're so close with charisma. Yes, we did it. We maxed the skill of charisma. Yes. She can also call Boston, negotiate a promotion, and upload a viral video. She is now a smooth talker. Oh my goodness, perfect. That's gonna be very helpful, I think, with getting people to like us immediately. I love that for me. Oh no, I hear someone crying. I think they're in the closet. No, no, no. Who is it? Okay, it's Rose Trippet. We don't know this person. It is not a person that I broke their heart. It is just someone else. Are you okay, Rose? Rose is just in there being upset. But ah, but there's my other girlfriend. Hi, Lizbeth. Oh my gosh, luckily, Julie is asleep. Hi, Rose. Are you okay? Oh, she did not appreciate me trying to console her. Rude, Rose. I was just trying to be nice. All right, I guess we're gonna go get a drink. I think you need one. Oh, Rose is sitting with us to chat. Okay, yeah. No, we're not gonna get a drink with you. You're being kind of nasty. We're drinking, we're sitting down. We are ignoring our girlfriend, Lisbeth, and we are just having a drink. All we need is to not get into trouble between these two ladies for the next couple seconds. She's making eyes at us though, Lisbeth is. Lisbeth is chatting with this alien. Luckily, Julia went to sleep. If Lisbeth tries anything, I don't think Julia is gonna see it. We made it, we made it. It was a great date, thank you. Okay, let's, uh, let's uh, travel. Salvatore Fowler, he was one that I was very interested in. Daniel Hobbs as well. Let's go with Salvatore though. Salvatore Fowler looks very cute. So let's go with him. You know, we didn't make him mad like Akira. Salvatore, oh, that is not the outfit I was 
hoping you would have, but let's go to the pool. That sounds like a fun date spot. We haven't gotten to the pool yet. Tell him a dirty joke. Wait, that is hilarious. You just hung out with this guy and you start with a dirty joke. That cracks me up. Oh my God, he loved it. Oh gosh, who's that? Who is that? Who is that? Okay, we don't know her. All right, let's flirt it up with this guy. We could go by the pool together. He is feeling, I think, pretty flirty with us. So this is good. I feel like we should change into our swimsuit. There we go. We're gonna be in our swimsuit. Oh, it looks like he's getting in the pool. Oh, they could swim together. I don't think they should skinny dip together. And then she can splash him. Just be a little flirty. Have a little fun. Oh, they're having a cute little hangout. Compliment his appearance. Can we sexy pose in the water? Like this is an interest that I have. This date is going very well. This not date date. First kiss, yes. Okay, they're gonna get out. Okay, ooh, what, is, what was that? He's embarrassed? Uh-oh, I hope he doesn't reject her. Oh, he didn't, yay! I was really worried that he would reject her because they just had like a weird moment. Oh, oh, Lauren completed the romance juggler of the serial aspiration. Now we just need to get Lauren gold on three dates. And we've already done have had eight boyfriends or girlfriends because we currently have 13. So everything is going according to plan. Oh, she needs to use the toilet. So she's using the toilet. Okay, maybe we should go sit here together after. We are seconds away from getting this guy to date us. Come on, be my 14th boyfriend. Oh no. Seema says, I don't want to pass moral judgments, but I heard that you were caught cheating on your partner. You should try to keep your private affairs more private. Oh, Seema, no! Wait, does Seema don't like us now? Nah, we're fine with Seema. Okay, everything's fine. Oh no. We didn't ask Salvatore Fowler if he's in a relationship and he has a spouse. It's Kaylee Fowler. Maybe they're in an open marriage. I'm gonna just assume that is the case because he did not seem all that fussed about making out with us in a public place. <gasps> he said no, he doesn't wanna be our boyfriend. Oh no, and he made her cry. Oh, that's so awkward. Oh my gosh, that is super awkward. What a jerk. Let's try one more time. Look at him. Weldon's like, I hate this PDA. Oh my God, now he said yes to be my boyfriend. And we took a photo together. Okay, well, Salvatore just became the boyfriend of Lauren. And we have officially had our first relationship with a married person. It was bound to happen eventually, but I didn't know it would happen today. So Salvatore Fowler is our 14th bay. So we have four. 14 boyfriends and girlfriends now, which is fantastic. There is also Akira, which part of me just like wants to see if he will come back around because he's kind of annoyed that he's, because he saw us cheating. He did not seem to, oh, <laughs> he says, I see you're in a good mood. Maybe we should head out and grab a drink. Yeah, maybe we should. Okay, he didn't seem to like us before, but he still asked us out for a drink after we sent him a little flirty text. So, you know. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Oh, we're in the bluffs. This is a perfect clandestine place. Okay, she's gonna seduce him. She's gonna go in hard. Oh wait, we really are tired. We should probably like wanna sleep, but brighten his day. Let's do like a little flirt as well. Cause she wants to flirt with somebody. Ooh, I wanna flirt with somebody. That's her song now. He seems to be easily swayed back into her side. She's very easily getting into his good graces here. They can have a little flirty moment by this bonfire. Can they both hang out together? Where did he go? <gasps> it went away. Okay, he like left. She kind of bought it with him and walked away that he immediately left. I think he's a playing a little hard to get. So let's uh, go travel to our uh, ride or dies house, Mr. Vlad, and just go to sleep at his place. What's up? Can I come inside? Can I come inside, Vlad? Vlad still really likes us, but it is all just romance. Oh my God, he's playing us stupid organ again. Just ignore him and go to sleep. Oh, she's passing out. There she goes. She's going off to sleep. Good night. Thank you for letting me borrow your bed as usual. Oh shoot. We have 24 hours to pay our bills. Oh, oh my gosh. Lauren, 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 call the fire department. Call the fire department. Oh my God. If Lauren burns to death, I'm going to die. I'm going to be so upset. Oh my gosh. I can't even save right now. Oh no. Oh no. Lauren, please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. Extinguish yourself. Extinguish yourself. 
Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. She survived. She is very tense because she was on fire, but she survived. We are okay. She's gonna go cook something. Oh my god. She is completely burned to a crisp. And our boyfriend just showed up and left. Shouting forbidden words. She is having a rough day. Vlad's like, hey, how are you doing? And she's like, um, I'm doing fine, except for you didn't help at all while I was literally on fire in your kitchen. She's venting to him. He's like, oh my gosh, I had no idea. She's gonna go eat her salad. <laughs> Oh, okay. She's a little better now. She's definitely singed. Oh my gosh. Well, she needs to use the toilet and then maybe the shower after. So we're gonna go back upstairs. Poor girl. This is honestly just too funny. We're gonna go shower everything off and then we're gonna try to go for our fifth boyfriend. We're going to ask Akira Kibo. Would you like to go on a date with me? Perfect. <gasps> Did he reject her? Ugh, where can I hide? That was an awkward conversation. Oh my gosh, I think he said no. Akira, you're such a jerk. You know, I love a challenge. I'm gonna take him out anyway. We're going back to the bluffs. We're redoing this date. All right, Akira. Maybe let's do a little self deprecating joke because we're pretty embarrassed. Oh my gosh, he seems so not interested. He probably is a hopeless romantic. So we are gonna just be friendly with him first. Oh, and he left. Ah, jerk. Akira, get your butt back over here. We are literally wasting time on this man. You know what? I'm going to circle back. I'm going to circle back. Who would I rather date next? This girl, Teulia Topsana. She seemed cool. Where would we go with her? Maybe Sulani? I'm afraid we might run into my mermaid girlfriend, but I can hope that we don't. Here we go. Okay, no one's at this beach. It seems pretty secluded. Okay, so let's change into our swimwear in the beach. You will not have to deal with the rain anymore. See, it's perfect. You can go swim around. See, she seemed to appreciate your venting. She did not mind it. Oh my gosh, is that my girlfriend again? Oh my gosh, is that Lizbeth? We're gonna be on our best behavior. Lizbeth, you always are like everywhere I go. I don't know how she does this. Look, we can see mermaids now because because our mermaid girlfriend revealed herself as a mermaid to us so we can see the other mermaids. Wait, what if they go here? They'll go to a little island where we're gonna swim over to get away from Lizbeth. Tell her a knock-knock joke. Okay, can she flirt with her from here? Lizbeth is still all the way over there. So let's, let's try. Let's try a little flirt, see what happens. Did Lizbeth see it? I don't think she did. Perfect. Okay. Flirt again. Oh, she's liking us. She's like finding us very charming. It's, ooh, it's already a suggestive conversation. I mean, we did bring her all the way out here. Yes. First kiss. Ooh, look at that kiss. Okay. Offer a rose. Oh, this is cute. I actually think they would be a very good match. Tallulah does not seem to take herself too seriously. <gasps> Ask to be girlfriend. I say this about like half the people that we date. I'm like, we could actually be a really good pair. <laughs> yes, we got another girlfriend. Take that, Akira. That takes us to 15 total bays in the challenge. We're doing great. Our old other bay did not see a thing. What's up, girl? We're still vibing, right? Yes, Lizbeth has no idea. I feel a lot of guilt for dating like 15 people and not telling each other and worrying about them catching me. But at the same time, it's kind of funny. Okay, now we're chatting with Melee. Hello. Should we do an enchanting introduction? I don't think there's anyone around that would be mad about us doing that. Do our enchanting introduction. Throw those love petals at her. Pacha! Okay, wait, unless he won't like it. <gasps> she did like it. I need to ask her first. Are you single? No, they are married. Oh my gosh, we just did an enchanting introduction in front of her husband. Okay, that's enough for me for today. All right, uh... <laughs> You know what we should do? We could show up at Akira's door because I know where he lives because I've lived there in another sim challenge. So we're gonna show up at his door and he will not be able to resist that romantic gesture. We're gonna knock down his door and be like, hey, I can't stop thinking about you. And I know that you're worried about me and I can't promise I will break your heart, but I can promise it'll be worth it. Let's see if he lets us in. We're wearing a very cute on 
ensemble. Come on in, he says. Okay, is he upstairs? Is he home? Akira is not here. Seriously? We're gonna travel with Akira. We're gonna travel back here. He's busy right now? Where is he? Oh my gosh, I am so annoyed. Maybe we'll wait until he gets home. There he is, we've been waiting. I came out like, hi, that is creepy. Oh my God, this is very creepy. Just flatter him. Okay, we're gonna make a little group. We're gonna add to a group and we're gonna have them sit together alone. We need to get you alone. Yes, get him alone. Maybe sexy pose. Show him what he's missing, girl. He liked it. Oh, and he immediately got flirty. We just have to like really slow but steady this one. Okay, here we go. He liked it. Boom, baby, let's go. Ask him if he's single. Maybe that is important to do. We got him right where we wanted him. He is single. Okay, first kiss is already upon us. Come on, bae. Come on, bae. You know you want to date us. Look at that cute face. Ooh, he gave a kiss. Oh my gosh, the roommate's like, whoa. Okay, he's liking us. Let's go sit in his bedroom. Okay, because this is not working when the roommates are around. Have a pickup line. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, oh no, oh no, no. We need to backtrack. We need to backtrack. Talk about the sunny weather. Be your charming self, girl. You got this. Compliment his outfit. You can see him. He wants her. He's just, I don't know. He's just playing so hard to get and I don't understand why. We're getting there. We're getting there. Woo and shower. Honestly, if it seals the deal, I'm ready to do what it takes. She's gonna ask him. Oh my gosh, here we go. Do you want a woohoo in the shower with me? He said yes. Oh my gosh. Okay, they're going for it. And she also really needs to go to the toilet. Oops. Okay, wow. Okay. Oh, I don't remember this shower in The Sims. Okay, whoop. They're, bro they're woohoo and afterwards we're gonna have to pee like a champion. You know, that's actually healthy to do as well to, to pee after woohoo, so. Okay, whoop. Okay, they, they finished their woohoo. Or maybe she can wake him up and be like, hey, do you want to be my boyfriend? Oh my gosh, but she's feeling clean and satisfied and it was her first woohoo too. It was nice and memorable. Can you wake up, sir? Okay, I'm still here. All right, and I have a question for you. Will you be my boyfriend? No? Oh my gosh, she just cried. Oh my gosh, we just woohooed with him and he won't be our boyfriend? Are you kidding me? <gasps> Did he just hit her? We're gonna go sleep in your bed. You're being rude, sir. I cannot believe he just did that. I'm gonna break your heart. I'm going to make things terrible for you, sir. I will make you my boyfriend and then I'll ignore the crap out of you. Oh yeah, you're gonna sleep in there? Good, good, sleep out of there. I'm gonna go have my own breakfast. Gonna have some oatmeal. It's gonna be delicious. She wants to woohoo with Akira again? Okay, where is Akira? Go wake him up. Maybe they'll have like anger woo-woo. <laughs> woohoo with Akira. He still said yes? I cannot believe he said yes to woohoo, but he has not said yes to being our boyfriend. He acted like he's so romantic. Like he's such a good guy. He's not at all. He's a jerk. Our girl is going to have the last laugh, okay? She's gonna brighten his day. Get back up. Make him your boyfriend. No, no, no. Akira, no. Akira. Oh my gosh, is he about to... Seema's wondering if I want to go over to her house and hang out. Yeah, okay. Just flipping woohooed with that guy twice for nothing. Then he left to go to work. It's not over, but we are with our girlfriend now, okay? We are at her place and we are going to kiss her in the rain because we deserve someone that loves us. Uh, and we also want to woohoo with someone, which is interesting. Now, when, once she used woohoo, she's gotten it into herself that she is a fan of the woohoo. <laughs> Well, we did show up. We did chat with her. Maybe we'll embrace her. And then I want to send a flirty text to Akira. See if I can just close this deal. We are chatting. We are flirting. Yes. Okay. He asked us to go grab a drink. Perfect. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I got so evil just then. Not in real life would I ever want this kind of toxic relationship, but in this, like, you, dude, it's for a challenge and you are being a jerk. I'm gonna ask you to be my boyfriend, okay? He said yes! I'm sorry, he said yes. And they're taking a photo and it's done. You are now my boyfriend. Akira Kibo 
is my 16th bay. He disappeared, which is totally like him, but it's fine. I don't care. I am going to find a new bay that is even better than you, Akira, and you're a jerk and I hate you, but I've collected you. Gotta collect them all, Pokemon. Daniel Hobbs. Let's take Daniel Hobbs back to my place, which is essentially a field. Slowly but surely getting to the point where we might need a house or a job. We're gonna pay our bills and then we're going to brighten his day and hopefully nobody that we know will walk by. Ooh, look at those muscle definition. He is toned. We're gonna give a little sexy pose for him. Oh, she's giving him a flower. That's very cute. Discuss interest, tell engaging story. Discuss interest. We gotta get there. We gotta get there. Okay, wait. Oh no, shoot. Seema, where did you come from? Why are you at my place? Hi, hi. Seema is really dogging me, man. Please do not flirt with him. Just stop talking to him. Go talk to Seema. Be like, okay, hi, Seema. Oh, wow. Okay, we immediately... Oh, is he gonna be bad? Is Daniel gonna be like, what the heck is that? Why did they just immediately make out? Oh my God, they're both flirty. This is... This is... I'm anxious. I am so anxious about this conversation. It's a pleasant conversation, so it doesn't seem like anyone's upset. She's leaving on her own. Crisis averted. <laughs> they're gonna have their first kiss. I think, like, look at him. I think he's into her. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. First First kiss. Cute. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Why is Seema here? Where was she? Oh, it's this awkward encounter. Where were you? How? Where? How? This is unfair game. Oh my gosh. You know what? I'm going to flee. No one's coming with me. I'm just fleeing. I'm fleeing the scene. Excuse me. Goodbye. I'm just going to peep my way out of this situation. I want to get one last bay before I go. We were getting really close with Daniel. So maybe we should invite him to hang out at this lot. Who is that? It's Julia. Oh my gosh. No, it's Julia, right? Can we like sit here together inside where Julia can't see me? There he is. Oh, he's riding his bike over. How cute is that? Oh, he wrote it right inside that is significantly less cute but let's compliment his outfit anyway offer him a rose this is so stressful juggling all these sims is a lot Whew, okay so this is taking a lot out of me but i think i think we're almost there as long as nobody finds out okay why are you sitting here and watching stop why are you just watching davis this is creepy can we ask you to be my boyfriend yet okay let's sit together over there no don't sit next to this guy please leave oh no Oh no, Daniel, I need you to be my bae. I can't, I can't let you leave. Okay, there we go. We're just with him now. This guy's next to us, but he's not in the conversation anymore, which is good. Okay, we're just talking over him. Wait, who's coming in the door? Not a girl I'm dating, it's Scarlet. Okay, great. And Akira's calling. Lauren, it's me, Akira. Do you wanna go out on a date? Yep, yep I do. Okay, well, we're on a date with Akira. I'm going to actually leave this here. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I cannot wait to download all of your bays in the next episode because to be honest, I am running out of bay options and I also am running out of places to go on dates. So make sure to upload some date locations onto the gallery. I want like bowling dates, restaurants, things like that. Oh, but yeah, we got six bays this episode, which was excellent. I hope uh, we will continue you getting more and more bays as we go along. So until next time, guys, I'll see you on the internet very soon.